Hey everybody, welcome back. Quick question, do you know what this thing's for? What I'm gonna do with it? That's the question of the day, let's find out. All right, did you guys guess? This thing here, it's supposed to be a hitch for our zero turn mower. Now, it's the middle of January. Why on earth would we need a hitch for our zero turn mower? If I'm being honest, I don't need a hitch for our zero turn mower in the middle of winter, but I will need one this summer. So the reason we need it this summer is Mrs. Woodward said she absolutely does not want to pull any weeds for our garden beds. So, okay, how does this fix that? My plan is, if I put this on the zero turn mower, she's comfortable driving the zero turn mower, and then I go get one of those lawn sweepers. I don't know if they work as well as they say they do, but if I, the plan is, I'll buy one of those things, and then she can pull that around with this, and then she can cover all her flowers and plants with grass clippings, and we have no weeds. Do any of you have a lawn sweeper thing? Does it work? Um, cause I was looking at the John Deere ones and they're about $400 and the non John Deere ones are maybe $325, probably all made at the exact same place. Um, so I'd really value your input before I go waste that money, provided it is a dumb idea. All right. But today's video is about the hitch. Where did I buy the hitch? Um, I was going to buy this when I first bought the mower and honestly, this is weird too. I think we bought, we have a, we have a John Deere 915 E and I think I paid like 6,000 something, maybe low 7,000s for it. I looked it up just before I came out here today. That is listed for over 10,000 bucks. There's no way I would have paid $10,000 for a lawnmower. But at the time this hitch was like 35 or $45. And I thought that was silly at the time. And it's even more money now. This one came off of Amazon for like, 17 something like that um i'm out here today to see if this thing does the holes line up will it actually work and if not then i guess we'll go to the store and go get some supplies but like will the 17 dollar i think it's 17 dollars will the, will the amazon the amazon special hitch has been painted green that's not john deere does it just work on the 900 series mower let's find out so as you can see, we do have the two default holes right here. Um, I don't know, well, it does line up pretty good. I don't know if it's supposed to go like that or it's supposed to go like that. So uh, if you know, tell me, that would be great. Um, it looks like the inside of these holes are already threaded. So I need to find out, or I, I, don't, I don't even know what to buy to try that so I guess I'll go to the store later and buy a whole bunch of them and see if I can make it work but right off the bat it looks to me like the $17 Amazon hitch at least does line up so we got that going for us so there's literally no chance like <laughs> I know myself pretty well there's absolutely no chance I would have any bolts um, I thought there was gonna be holes and you put the bolt and have to go put a washer and nut on this to make it work um, either way, I've got to go to town or go down to the farm store and see if I can find something. I didn't know that those were going to be threaded, so you, I guess your guess is as good as mine. I'm going to go try to Google that and see if I can figure that out. Um, but I'll be right back and I'll have a bunch of bolts to try. What's up? I'm back. It's the next day. I've been to the tractor store. I got some bolts. Um, I went on the old interweb last night and I was looking to try to figure out what size bolts I need. I found three different documents from John Deere or Frontier and they all said three different sizes. M12 45, M12 by 25, M12 by 30. Um, I bought every 12 millimeter bolt they basically had in every single size so uh, I think we're going to be good. How much money did I spend today on bolts? Um, one of these bags was two dollars and my goodness one of these this bag was like nine dollars so i may that doesn't feel like me i 
Didn't realize I spent $9 on one bag of bolts. But nevertheless, it's not about that. It's about getting the hitch on to be able to sweep up grass, I guess. Um, also got a pin, provided this works. Um, it's a half inch pin. I know what you're thinking. Did you get a big enough pin? Or like, Jesus man, did you get a big enough pin? Yeah, I think I did. Let's go out to the barn and see if this will actually work. It's negative seven degrees today, so clearly this is our number one priority is to get this lawnmower figured out. Um, it's cold, cold, cold. Let's, let's see if any of these bolts actually fit, and if they do, then we can move forward. Uh, let's see, does this work? Uh, it kind of starts and then it gets snug. Let's just... It doesn't appear to line up with this end. Um, hmm. If that would just screw in, that would be pretty sweet. I think that thing's on there as tight as it literally ever needs to be. Again, I'm gonna pull maybe what, a, a lawn sweeper? Um, why, why would you, I don't even understand what else you actually think you're gonna pull with this thing. But I'm gonna show you what I did, you tell me if it works. Solid. Will those bolts ever rust out? Yeah, maybe, but like our mower, never leaves the barn it our mower is stored inside all the time so i don't i don't know i don't know why it would ever be a problem now the ones i looked at last night from frontier or directly from john deere they say that that thing is rated to pull 400 pounds that's a lot of grass man i don't know like let's say i had a i don't know a log so I had to move a heavy ass log. The last machine I'm gonna to go to to pull that thing out is my lawnmower. So I think it's gonna work. I think we're good to go. Again, it was $13. Let's see, how much did I pay for it? I wrote it down. I paid $13.99 for that. And it was $38.51 if you bought the John Deere one from Green Tractor Parts, Green Parts Store or something like that. So. Um, let me know, let me know how I did. Is that going to work? Would you have bought the cheap one as well? Or would have you spent the money to get the John Deere one? So, uh, thanks for watching. I'll be back in a couple of days with another silly project. Thank you. Bye.